Good afternoon, everybody. Happy Sunday. Happy Daylight Savings Time. Daylight Saving Time. Ugh. Uh, welcome to stream. It is awesome to have you here, Nobu and Sabs and any lurkers. Um, and yeah. Oh, okay. We we playing Dorf today, but. Don't get me wrong, I still like Dorf. I very like Dorf. But this game... This game exhausts me. Um, when I'm playing it, it's fantastic. But when I'm not playing it, I don't want to keep playing it because it scares me. There's just, there's so much. <gasps> Hello, Kingfisher. Let us continue our active game. They looked really nice, Kingfisher. Ugh, EP. Okay. Uh... I don't entirely remember what I was doing, but we have a guinea pig. The flower bouquet is different to the wildflower bouquet. Neat. Uh, iron bolt. Why is that locked? Uh, one day I'll remember the controls for this game. Today is not that day. Uh, oh yeah, this was... Smage's advice for making just lots and lots of apartments. So now a lot of people have homes and are probably a bit less miserable. Uh, I know, I know the game's paused. I just want to kind of orient myself. Uh, okay. So there is something I wanted to do which is this stockpile. I want to... repaint it. Because I just don't need that much of it. And then I can... set this to be... Uh, whatever you call it. A, yeah, a pen. For animals. Um, because that is better than the outside one, because then the animals don't have to get, uh, get all wet. One petition outstanding. I think I was already doing that. 16 thieving or mischievous creatures are on the map. Uh, yeah, you can. One group of citizens is stranded? Oh, yeah. Well, stop coming downstairs. It is dangerous here. Fine, open it up. Hello, Crow. Uh, apparently not, Crow. That's the one thing this game doesn't have, apparently. Okay. Uh... The mayor has ended a mandate. There's so much vomit. Who, who's throwing up and for why? Ugh. Yeah, someone's gonna have to clean that. So we've got a bunch of naked mole dogs attacking us. Oh, this makes me so happy. The fact that normally Dwarves adopt animals, but apparently cats adopt dwarves. They knew.
They understood. Man, Velheim scares me too. Uh, yeah, this pen I wanted to assign animals here. Duck, Drake. Uh, I don't think we need to worry about pets. Piglet? Hell yeah. I'm trying to make a ranger's guild. Please. No one will make my statues. Imposed a ban on certain exports. Uh, God, how do I see what this is? Officers? No, that's work orders. Nobles. No, I've got lots of willing sculptors. I just don't have the stuff they need to sculpt. Seems to be the problem. Also, there are fewer miserable people, but most of the miserable people are still children. Because children in this game are just never satisfied. Uh... Yeah, we killed a lot of troglodytes. Uh... There has to be some way to see what's been banned. In fact, I know there's some way to see what's been banned. still need to improve their study. Oh lord. How do I do that? Oh, I'm... Smage, where are you? stocks okay whatever I had plans for today, and they're immediately out the window. I thought this was a sufficient study for you. Export of floodgates prohibited. Okay, cool. That's the thing. Um... Oh wait, this is this is your dining room. Your study still sucks ass. Um What? Why are you stumbling around obliviously? Oh, someone else is going to die and there's nothing I can do about it. And I'm really sad now. I just... I want to 
figure out what's up. Um, I can make a rock statue. The emu is fighting. Uh, man, Smage did definitely recommend that I. That I do something with this. Uh, okay, what are these? That can give me silver and lead. We've got quite a bit of Galena. Oh lord. Okay. Smelt some limonite. But we don't have enough ore. That uh, enough fuel. I I am so overwhelmed. I'm sorry, are these two a couple? No, they're both children. They just like hanging out in the same room. Which, you know, fair enough. Uh, oh lord. Uh, look, I've got food, I've got drinks. Ish. Um, my problem is that right now everything sucks. Um, Construction is suspended. Oh, they weren't even trying to. Like, the statues were made, just no one was putting them there. That's on me for not understanding the incredibly weird user interface. Uh, a sylvite statue of sea otters. You know what? How does that not make you happy? That's got to be, like, the best study ever, right? Uh... It's a... Is there a difference between an office and a study? I don't think so. Make, make another statue, I guess? Okay, these have been placed. Um, uh, 
Uh, it's approximately 2,000. It needs to be exactly 2,000. Um, which makes me think that it's not quite there yet. That's fine. Um, you know what? I need a military. It is becoming abundantly clear that we've got issues. Stop vomiting! Oh my lord! Crow. I have no idea at this point. I am so overwhelmed. Um, I came into this originally planning to deal with all of the problems, and then the game just went, haha, have a thousand problems. I'm still dealing with one of those. I, I need to start setting up a barracks. Um... Let's just do a five by five area to start. Please somebody kill these dang dogs. phrase I'm pleased to say. Yes, dwarven child, do your job. Uh, okay. Barracks. I can make the barracks bigger if I need to. Squads? What do you mean, squads? Ooh, hoo hoo. Okay. Cancel that. I'll I'll figure that out eventually. Oh good, there's significantly less vomit. Position is not outstanding. No, they have a guild hall. I signed it and everything. The Rosie Company, yeah, it's assigned. They don't need the ten thousand. Okay, so this, by the way, is a new feature of DFAC, and I adore it. Um, but 
It's... Like, okay, so I've got a guild hall for the Earthen Guild. And I've got one for, for this guild. It's like, what's the issue here? Unnamed Sculpture Garden? Did I never actually assign this as a guild hall? Am I just a dingus? No. I don't know, chat. They're just not satisfied. Okay, it just took a while. That's fine. statues. Ooh, a jet black statue. You gotta love it. <laughs> yeah, a statue of Jack Black. Um, so this doesn't give me, uh, like the value levels that the other thing did. Um, but it's still not good enough. You're going to demand more statues, aren't you? Fine, you can have a fancy silver statue if that's what it takes to satisfy you. Why do I have so many doors? I know that seems like an odd question. Uh, okay. Just for the sake of being neat, and because I have them available, uh, let's, let's put a door at the entrance to the hospital. And let's put one at the entrance to... What I'm going to say is eventually going to be a barracks. There we go. Guildhall Company has been... Guildhall Agreement. Okay, do I need to make, like, a shit ton more weapons? Is this what I just need now? Um, just, just make some axes and some swords and... Because maybe that's the issue. Maybe I don't have the necessary weapons to kill dogs. Spears are good weapons. It's the fucking emu. Okay, so we still got a dormitory. 
It's not ideal, but we've also got apartments. <laughs> a profit? Can he tell me if I'm going to make it through the next year? Because, yeah, I'm doubting it. Yeah, the soundtrack is very cool. Yeah, you know what? Just just hide here for a while. I don't blame you. Okay. I don't have any squads yet, but I can still make a barracks. Yeah, it's a spattering of naked mole dog blood. Um, militia commander. Um, okay, do I have anybody who would make a good militia commander? Uh, maybe the rangers? I've got rangers and hunters. But I don't seem to have any warriors that I can see. No relevant skills. That's an issue. Um... Okay. So this... This person's just gonna have to learn how to be a ranger. God, Crow, if I knew, I would immediately tell you. Um, like, what does a hammerer even do? Nothing any of them can do. What's a dungeon master? God, I wish this game would explain things. Kingfisher. That sounds rad. Okay, so... I can make a... a, a messenger, apparently. I don't know what that does. library, I guess. Okay. 
given birth to a girl. Okay, we got babies. Excuse me? A, a gremlin? I I don't know how to drive it away. I don't even know where it is. Oh, you're horrible. 268 years old, my lord. Patient, frail, poor spatial sense, not creative, values hard work, sloppy. I... Uh, I, I may well switch off the Pokemon community game. Because I don't feel like modding it. Uh, she has a deep well of patience, a feel for music, and a good memory. But she has poor focus, little willpower, lousy creativity, and an atrocious spatial sense. She is sloppy with her living space. She finds a chaotic mess preferable to the boredom of harmonious living. I love the detail they make for these characters. Um... As uh, she is very curious, sometimes to her detriment, she is sometimes cruel. She dislikes obligations and will try to avoid being bound by them. She tends to avoid any physical confrontations. She has a tendency to go it alone without considering the advice of others. She thinks she is fairly important in the grand scheme of things. She likes a little excitement now and then. She tends to be passive in discussions. She doesn't handle stress well. She tries to do things correctly each time. She is grateful when others help her out and tries to return favors. She tends to hang on to grievances. She's a friendly individual. This is a random gremlin. Okay. So, idea is just close the damn door. I appreciate the fact that, as far as I can tell, this kid is literally just hanging out here. <laughs> Hello, Beba. Yes. It is incredibly chaotic. And we've got a lot of naked mole dogs. Which I am not about at the moment. Uh, thank you for the dudes as well, Beba. Hello? Is there a rat eating my food? Uh, I should probably figure out this stuff. What's a traction bench? I, I, who even knows at this point? Apparently I need a table. No! Why are you depressed? Uh...
I think these naked mole dogs are just like part of our community at this point. As is this troglodyte. He's just a little guy. Hell yeah, Beba. Scatterbrained, value self-control, recovers quickly, clumsy, high willpower, gracious. Novice fighter, novice striker, dabbling armor user, dabbling discipline, dabbling observer. That's... This is amazing. This is just a random monster. Wearing a sock on its left hand and a glove on its right hand. Okay, so these are house elves. God, Crow, I did enjoy Escape from LA. I don't think I ever saw Escape from New York. Okay, I've got to figure out. Those are miners. Okay, these are just work details. Uh, if you have a law enforcement administrator like a sheriff or captain of the guard, witnesses of crimes will make reports which find their way here. Certain crimes are indicative of larger problems, so you should pay attention to them and affected victims and family members get upset if crime is ignored. It's up to you to choose whom to convict. Why is it up to me? All available witness information is presented for each case. You can also interrogate suspects. This is particularly important for schemes where the witnesses might not have the full story. It is recommended to place a certain number of cages and chains and assign them to a dungeon zone. Officers may opt for physical punishment if they cannot carry out custodial sentences. Oh my lord. Uh, so Kingfisher, if you just do Poke Catch, it uses just a Pokeball. Um, you only need to say the ball type for anything above Pokeball. Okay. Oh, once I've got a militia commander, I also need a militia captain. Can that be the same person? Can that also be Mebzuth? It cannot. Again, nobody has any relevant skills. Um, so we'll just keep it to the rangers. Okay, once I've got a militia captain, can I assign them to this? Okay, no, how do I make squads? Ew, Crow. Why'd you have to make it so bad? Um, okay. That's objects. I saw an axe and I thought, haha, perhaps this is weapons? No, no, it was not. Uh... Corpse stockpile is a wonderful sentence. Oh! See, I didn't look at the bottom right of my screen. I looked at the bottom left of my screen. 
This is the squad menu. Here you can create squads, fill your positions, assign equipment and schedules, and give specific orders. It is recommended that you prepare a squad and get them training as soon as you can. It is currently year five. <laughs> so that went well. You have no idea what's lurking out there. Before Napoleon and Hitler, another man tried to take over Europe and met his end as a result of battling with Russia. Do you know who he was? Uh, I don't really, Kingfisher. Hit me with it. This is a hidden icon with no tutorial to find it. It's almost like an Easter egg, but necessary. This fucking game. Ooh, I've never heard of Cowardless Rex. Uh, tell me more, Kingfisher. I am interested. Captain of the Guard Squad. Okay, so there can be multiple squads. The Militia Commander Squad. Okay, so I can make shit for them. Let's make some... <sighs> do I want to go bow and arrow? Do I want to go metal armor? Let's go metal armor. Which will require me to make some metal armor. I understand that. Man, I should listen to some Sabaton. Okay, you know what? No. Let's start with no uniform. We can fix it afterwards. Captain. Melee effectiveness. Okay, nobody is above a 29. No, we've got somebody who is a 30, but they're a bookkeeper. Why is the bookkeeper so good at fighting? Oh my lord, Kingfisher, that is... that is big, yes. Animal Caretaker. Okay. I think having three people to begin with is good. Okay. Um, they're not great, but you know. We do what we can. Soldiers will stand near the point selected and engage Okay, so you... This is very useful. I wish the game gave you any information about it. Yeah, Crow, I've, I've done that. It sucks. Uh, burrow defense order. The soldiers will patrol the burrow and attack any hostile creatures. That sounds useful. Okay. Okay, so now what I can do... 
don't want to disband the squad. I just want to get rid of it. Now what I can do is assign the buff orbs here to train. Cool. I assume. Yeah. That seems like a thing. Um, and then... Custom uniform. Oh, jeez. What... What do these symbols even mean? Whatever, go train. How do I... Train. Not... I don't want constant training. Staggered training. Yeah. Okay. Is that good? Is that bad? I think that one symbol indicates that the dwarf in question urinates sitting down as a matter of personal preference, and not simply mechanically obligated. I mean... It's as good an explanation as any other. Crow, you're not not helping. What more do you want from your study? I've given you so many statues. Okay, let's, uh, windows, oh, oh my lord, I think today might be the last, not because I don't like this game, but just because it's too much. Like, I don't think I can keep playing this. Oh no, withdraws from society. That's always a concern. I didn't know how much this was going to be. Let me be clear about that. Shadow Mage is going to be incredibly disappointed, and and I don't think I have any way to actually sufficiently care. It's just too much. It's such a cool game. It genuinely is really cool. just also can't anyway that's going to be a library but i want it to be a pretty library 
your training. Cool. Okay. Moody Dwarf is gathering items. I mean, I'm glad the game gives me that kind of thing. Kingfisher, I, I do not have the wherewithal to uh, to do organ harvesting, which is the only thing I know about that game. I mean, I do have a very stressful thing planned for my next Sunday stream. I just didn't know it was going to come so soon. Uh, which is, I want to learn a new speedrun. I actually want to play Helldivers. Hello? Why is there so much miasma? Is this on account of all the rotting bodies? The Doc is the only one consistently fighting the Mole Rats. I don't think the Naked Mole Rats are really much of an issue. I think the Dog is the problem, bizarrely. Helldivers looks really cool. I mean, you all know I have a place in my heart for... Um, for weird co-op games. Ooh, begun a mysterious construction. Uh, Smunstu Granite Seduced wishes to reside in Endwheel for the purpose of eradicating monsters. Approve immediately, oh my lord. Uh, actually, do I need to. Anybody else who needs to move here? Uh, no. No. Nah. Yeah, I've heard about that, Crow. It's, it's a wild concept. Uh, okay. Do I have a door? I don't need a door, but I'd like a door. I don't have a door. Okay, that's fine. Uh, meeting area... And specifically, make it a library. The Home of Whips. That is not your name, sir. Not if I can help it. Uh, now, we will go with the slightly spooky Hall of Whispers. So I need bookcases, tables, and chairs. Uh, so we also need writing materials. And a scholar and a scribe. Okay, this is going to be a little, uh, need to be a little bit bigger than it currently is, it turns out. That's fine. Uh, 
Uh, make a chair. Let's make a table. Cook has created uh, Isaac Desrim, a limonite scepter. She offers it to the whirling treaties. Neat. Uh, what I can do so long is at least put down some bookshelves. Excuse me? Oh, an elven caravan has arrived. Uh, I thought named animals didn't have to be put in pens, but I was clearly incorrect. Dogs and cats are probably okay. But it looks like the rest do have to be put. That's fine. That should help. Uh, broker requested at depot and move my gems. doesn't contain gems. That doesn't seem to contain gems. Uh, yeah, we can probably sell some of those things. the gem bin is most of where we're going to make our money. Okay, let's smooth out these walls. Hey, that's appropriate. I also love the sweet stuff. rough. I've got a lot of uncut gems, which really surprises me. Uh, first, let's see if there's anything we actually want. Um, not, not so far. I can make wooden swords if it comes to it. 
I'll get some bows. Uh, okay. I don't need crowns. Uh, we'll get some apples and some bayberries. That's definitely worthwhile. Don't need splints, really. Yeah, so I don't need to offer that much. Um, yeah, that wasn't great. See, Seacrow, I think that's more my speed. I'm a big fan of city builders. Yep, this definitely isn't a terrible thing. What does it take to make you satisfied with your study? Oh my lord. can't smooth it out because it's above ground. Well, above the rock layer. Which would probably actually help a lot. Uh, I have a terrible feeling that... Oh, we're super low on wood. Yeah. I mean, you're not wrong. Those things sound rad. Oops, I did need to do some more of that. Uh, and then I can also... I made a table and chair, I think. Uh, get this all tossed, even though we're going to end up using some of it. Oh, nice, Beba! That is incredibly poggers news. Hell yeah, Crow. Uh, I haven't exercised much this week because I got sick and I also seriously overdid it on uh, last weekend. But I still have to do a workout today. Which, given that I'm like 80% full of uh, lasagna at the moment, eh, that's going to take some, <laughs> some doing. Oh, 
Oh, hell yes, Crow. I mean, technically, I'm also setting personal records, but those records are more in the the ability to move realm. Because without wanting to put myself down, I've been a bit of a tubalard for a while. I wish I could, like, bring this guy, like, into the fold. Like, combat history? I just, I want to make you a citizen. Bonkers as it sounds. You've been around for a while. It's always that dog that's causing problems with the naked mole rats. Oh no, I, I'm the same, Crow. I'm not trying to get buff. Uh, I would just like to not be winded after walking up a single flight of stairs, which is the position I have been in for a while. Which, let me tell you, feels not great. Writing materials desired. Okay, this is this is a start for a library. Gems. Keep doing that till there ain't no gems to cut. Melt some sphalerite, I guess. Is anybody actually getting better at fighting? Hmm. Sure doesn't look like this training is doing anything. Oh well. Plenty of wood now. Let's make some more bookcases. I know this isn't important. Like, Lord, this isn't important. 
but I've got so little that I can figure out. Excuse me, training axes? Oh. Is this why they're not getting better? At least I've got food and booze. Ooh, masterpiece. Oh yeah, I should... Put it on repeat. And then also after that, do all of the limonite. Oh, that's depressing. This man is sleeping on the bed in the storeroom. No, that... That's a step too far. You know, you would think, Crow, but that's apparently the one thing in this game that isn't accurate. Why are you down there? Oh my lord. Please, my man, make your way back home. Who even are you? A hammer dwarf. I... sure... Just do your best to to get back.
Why is there a granny down here? You know what? You all clearly want to die. And I'm not going to stop you. Merchants have left. Hunter is hunting. The dwarven child is stumbling around. It's fine. Nobody died yet today. How bad can things really be? If things were really bad, people would be dying. They're not. So it's alright. Uh, Guild of Intensity, an animal caretaker guild. Sure, I'll make you a guild hall. Has become a wrestler. That was not one I was expecting. Use rooms. Those aren't your rooms. Meanwhile, let's... Whoops. Actually, what are my stocks looking like? Uh, it's statues. Okay, so I've got five silver... S well, not necessarily all silver. Uh, but I've got five statues available. I can see if that is sufficient. Okay. The starving man managed to make his way up here where he will hopefully find something to eat and or drink. curious about is like, how do I make parchment okay that's if I want to make writing materials oil containing items lime containing items why do I have two of these places
Okay, and let's do some smoothing. Whoops, a daisy. Uh, we can do some smoothing here as well, and eventually some carving. I, Kingfisher, I, I feel like I now have a right and a duty to see them. Keep scrolling too far up. Yeah, lots of people have that issue, Josh. It's rough. Because you lose an hour of sleep. The dragon Sarvesh Kadolnilas, Kad uh, Sirabestrath, has come. A gigantic reptilian creature. It is magical and can breathe fire. These monsters can live for thousands of years. Well, what am I supposed to do about that? Okay, so this may be the end of this of this timeline. Oh I think it's done. I think we're done. what I could have done about that. I do know the game is running quite slowly at the moment, as it has to calculate everything that's burning. A ghostly sword dwarf is, has risen and is haunting the fortress. Uh, so that's... Uh, hi, LV. Um, my fortress is being besieged by a dragon who just walked in and destroyed it. Um, how are things for you? Oh, you don't need to apologize, LV. We all have our own lives. Also, the game cannot keep up with the amount of fire. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, LB. I'm glad you'll survive. 
That makes you very different from these dwarves. It is, Beba. Ah, the game runs faster if, if I don't watch it happening. Really? I, has a dwarf been found dead? Who could imagine such a thing would occur? What, what could have caused that? I wonder. Oh, it's so slow. At this point, I I have just accepted the inevitable. You know what I'm going to say? I was already feeling like this was the last stream. And if you're gonna have a last stream, I can't imagine a better way to do it than an actual dragon comes and just decides you're done. It's so slow now because it's got to calculate all of these things being burned at the same time. Bebo, what I wouldn't give to do that. I genuinely don't know what I could have done about this. But I do want to watch it for a while at least. I think it's barrels like this that have a bunch of things in them. that are slowing things down. Because, like, I've got a moderately beefy computer. I wouldn't expect it to struggle this much. I'm assuming there's not much I could do to damage the dragon. Man, I thought the gremlin was bad. Uh, I know nothing about Dragon's Dogma, LV. I've heard of it, but I just I just don't know what it is. <laughs> I'm sorry. I think it's very funny that this is listed as a warm silt wall. Warm. I, I wonder what caused that warmness. Oh lord, there's a person in that bed. There's a child in that bed. Oh, that's... That somehow seems worse than if it was just the bed or just the child. Oh my lord. That was my mayor. Is that why they elected a new mayor? God, dwarfs are efficient. Like, hmm. Mayor's dead due to dragon. Now, we can deal with this dragon situation, but before that... I, I don't know, LV. I can't explain it. I'm 
sorry. Oh, that's the ghostly sword tour. I was wondering, like, why, why, why is this woman green? And while she is, it is mostly because of her deadness. Man, I tried. Nobody can deny that I tried this game. That I have done... Maybe not my best, but something. Fine, I'll mod you, Pokemon Community Game, but I won't like it. Why are you happy? Rainbow seems like the inappropriate response, actually, ma'am. Uh, I'm just going to send uh, a single word to Smage. Because I think the word dragon is, is all that's needed. Oh my lord, my computer just cannot handle this. Kingfisher, I, I don't know how you figured it out. The dragon's making his way. Yeah. Good time to stretch. Very good time to hydrate, especially for dwarves. Oh my lord, the game is just desperately chugging along. Weirdly, the people in this little meeting room are probably going to be fine for a little while. I'm genuinely shocked that it is... that it is fighting this hard just to make anything happen. This person is still like, super happy with rainbows. Gruesome wounds, be gone, fear. She's annoyed after choking on smoke. She's afraid after experiencing trauma. Uh, she doesn't feel anything after seeing Imush Bra uh, Braspas die, which is a concern. She's seven years old. Hmm. Yeah, that's pretty accurate, Josh. Man, the dragon is just... Not going anywhere. Really, the whole game is sort of not going anywhere at the moment.
you know, like, it won't happen. But it would be very fun if we could trap the dragon in the deep underground and just let him deal with all the gremlins and things. How dare it rain now. Above ground, but not where I need it. Oh, nice. Someone's upper left leg. Heh <laughs> Char. That seems appropriate. Um, so, punk, um, what you walked in on is a dragon, uh, who has set everything on fire, um, and Dwarf Fortress trying really, really hard to keep up, and failing magnificently, because now my game's running at, like, five frames a second. Um, so I was feeling massively overwhelmed, and I wasn't sure I was going to do more of this. Um, now I can say with some confidence, I'm probably not going to do more of this. No, no, there's the dragon, surrounded by smoke. Because I have no, I have no soldiers at the moment. I had three people busy training, but they don't have equipment because... I left everything quite late, because the game hides the squad thing way down in the bottom right, where it's like impossible to actually find. No, the dragon is still alive and well. I'm also not sure I could have fought the dragon. If there was a way I could make this run faster, I would be so jazzed about that. Okay, I did not know traps were that effective. That is good to know. That is good to know if I do this again in the future, which is no guarantee. Oh my lord, it's so slow. I mean, don't get me wrong, I have thoroughly enjoyed this game. Let's say I probably need a little break from the game, because... Please, please, please no. Have you not done enough? These were the three dwarves who might actually have survived. Oh, is it slowly running at a better frame rate? Okay, so that would also have been an option. I mean, at this point, like, I ain't, gonna, I ain't even gonna try to recover from this. I just want to see how far this goes. I find it funny that forbidding, that just like locking a door is apparently sufficient to keep out actual dragons. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Dwarven child. Of course you're miserable. She's annoyed after choking on smoke underground? That's the wrong word. Um... 
Yeah, uh, what, what happened is what is essentially a natural disaster on four legs. I'm concerned that you didn't feel anything after seeing several people die. Overcautious but trusting, an interesting combination. Oh! Oh, now on fire, which I think is worse. You know, LV, I, I genuinely don't know. Uh, requ recovers quickly, resists sickness. No official position. Seriously injured? Oh, interesting. Oh. Is she killing herself with smoke? That would be quite funny. Because I don't think we did much to injure her. Sarvesh gem flickered the warm jewels. Hell yeah, that's a good name. Oh, even the... Even the menus are slow. Uh, personality. She has a great feel for social relationships. Does she? A great affinity for language, willpower, and good creativity. I don't know about the whole social relationships thing. She is very comfortable around others that are different from herself, unless those others are dwarves. She's a friendly individual. Why do you lie to me? At some point, the fire will bur will stop and my CPU will catch up. I mean, in theory. Oh. Oh, this is a toy. Because there were children in this room, including the child that's currently on fire. What are you doing, Mr. Dwarf Man? Well, it went quickly for a little while. And, and that's it. Ma'am, you're just leaving? Do fires spread downstairs? They don't. Okay. Oh, 
lord. But at least she's not assaulting the, f the fortress anymore. Oh! Fucking gremlin as well? Okay, no. I can only deal with so much, and this is it. I could try to deal with a gremlin. I could try to deal with a dragon. A... A, a dremlin? A, a dragon? Nah. I'm sorry. Is she chasing the moose? She's wildly aggressive. Dwarven Child has been missing for a week. Oh, -ho. Dwarven Child is dead. I think we can assume that. Yes, yes, I got dragoned. I'm kind of disappointed that she isn't sticking to the actual fortress at this point. Uh... Why has everybody been missing for a week? Have they just forgotten about the kids who died in the dormitory? Oh, that's super useful. Thank you. Well, I appreciate that people are still having babies. Oh, this is devastating. And yet watching it just go into a dormitory full of children and set the place on fire. That was the worst thing that happened. For, I think, understandable reasons. <laughs> you know what? I'll take that as a compliment. <sighs> okay. Dwarf Fortress is probably the best simulation and management sim in the world and desperately needs to be more noob friendly it needs like like an i've never played dwarf fortress mode because like why are squads hidden in some tiny corner that's crucial stuff um I know it's got tutorial stuff, and the tutorial stuff was helpful. I, I think the game's just too much for me. I do want to play it again. Today's not that day. But I think for what it is, nothing has ever done what it does nearly as well. So I'll give it an A plus best in class. Oh lord, those poor emus.
Dwarven child has slipped into depression. Oh, oh, is that maybe something to do with all of your friends dying? Could that be the cause of you slipping into depression? Man, I will be playing this game again. I absolutely know I will. Oh no. Hello. <laughs> Excuse me, something has collapsed on the surface. Yeah. Hey Smage, remember when I had a dormitory? And do you remember when that dormitory had a bunch of children in it? I mean, he didn't go further, uh, she didn't go further down, which is a blessing, but... Oh, also, there's a lot of farts. Oh yeah, all the trees are burning down. Neat. Ah, okay. She took her time, but she's here. They did nothing wrong. <laughs> It was just on the same tile as something else, so it was glitching in and out. Well, not glitching, but... <laughs> oh, oh, the temple! <laughs> Where is your god now? <laughs> Look at my population! My population was 141 when this started. <laughs> also, I'm sorry. Why? How did a Kestrel get down here? That's just wild. never financially recover from this. Oh hey, it started raining. You all have got to stop electing mayors, please. <laughs> Mm. 
So all of the trees are collapsing on top of our poor little land. Everybody is going to die. Correct, Trump. My population... Is, is that a nose? No, that's a right ear. Oh, Lord. I tried so hard and got so far. But in the end, a dragon just fucked me up. It's not better than a nose, it's just different than a nose. Oh, well, she was severely injured, but now she's fine. I'm sorry, does she not want to go underground because of the miasma? That's kind of hilarious. Man, I even started like training people in in mi the military it was going so well until it wasn't wait uh i do still want to follow her she's where the exciting stuff is through quite a process of electing mayors, huh? Well, Smage, I, w I was complaining about feeling overwhelmed in this game. And I'm going to be honest, I don't feel particularly overwhelmed anymore. I feel like I've got a pretty good handle on, on on what's going on. You know, this isn't Dwarf Fortress anymore. This is now Dragon Fortress. Struck Ruby. Have I game? <laughs> wow. Thank you. Oh. And everybody who's not dead is missing. Who is happy? Who? Tell me, how dare you? Oh, you're the mayor. You're the mayor and you're boozing it up. Of course you're happy. <laughs> I've got so few people left. Everything's burned down. I'm done. I've accepted this. Okay, apparently we're not allowed to have leggings. Dwarven child has been found melted. You know what? I I'm not making your guild hole, buddy.
More trees collapsing. Okay. I think... I think we're about done here. <laughs> nope. Nope. She's still finding things to kill. Oh my lord. Ma'am, please. Ma'am, please, the llama did nothing to you. Did she just kill a ghost? Population 2. I am curious where they are. Actually, how dare you sleep under the circumstances? This is getting out of hand. <laughs> oh, thank you, Trump. You, you done, ma'am? No, no, you're not done. Population one. You know, do you really get to be elected mayor if you're just the only person alive? Why are you visiting? Peddler has been found dead. I... I understand. Why are you unloading your goods? Is it not clear that shit has gone south? Oh my lord. That was just... Such a wild way for this to end. Withered, your settlement has crumbled to its end. And thus, ends my first attempt at Dwarf Fortress. The second attempt will not start immediately. The second attempt will start eventually, but it will not start immediately. Punk McFunk, thank you for the Star Storm. I, I forgot. The, the name of the dragon. This is a good song, though. You're right. That, that was so much. This game has been a lot to deal with all the way through, and I was okay with it. And then there was a dragon. I could deal with troglodytes. Hell, I had a troglodyte who was just part of my society. He was fine. He was a friend. Um, the only fighting I had consistently happening was that the dog didn't like the naked cave dog, and they kept getting into scraps. But, you know, I could deal with that. Then a gremlin happened, and I was not about the gremlin. But I just, I sealed off the underground, the gremlin went away. And then a fucking dragon happened. Oh lord, there are clowns. Uh, but yeah, look, 
The game is fantastic. I am going to need a lot more time to actually, like, do this. But it is fantastic. It is, it's a one-of-a-kind game. There are other management sims, there are other simulators, there are other city builders. I don't think there's anything close to this scale anywhere in the world. Um, and if there is, I kind of don't want to know because I'm terrified. Um, so yeah, I'm going to... I, I am going to make this a short stream because... I, look what happened! Um, but yeah, let's, let's see who we can raid. Yeah, adventure mode, I don't really know what's up with that. Um, uh, let's raid Max. Um, I appreciate all of y'all for being here, by the way. Um... In spite of the chaotic and absurd way things ended. Um, but yeah. Uh, genuinely, thank you for, for joining me. Um, I've grown old and infirmed. <laughs> I, I'm ancient now. I'm different. I'm older. I'm peaceful. I'm, I'm an old hag, Steve. I just give up. I'm an old backpack vendor. I give gifts. <laughs> no, no, no one grew old. I'm sure they would have liked to, but it didn't happen. Uh, but yeah. So, uh, next week, Sunday, I'm going to start practicing a new speedrun. Um, I've, I've done the Balan speedrun for a while, but I'm looking to practice something new, uh, which, by the looks of it, will be, like, almost the same length or longer. So, eh, you know, I make decisions. But yeah. Uh, my next stream will be this coming Wednesday at 5.30 Eastern Time, where I'm going to be starting something else that I've never played before. Something much smaller than this, but uh, yeah, I'm very much looking forward to uh, playing Super Mario Bros. 3, or Super Mario 3, whatever it's officially called. Uh, one day, Trom. But yeah, thank you all very much for joining me. Uh, say hi to Max, and yeah. I will see you all around, and I hope you all have a great afternoon. Have a good one, everybody. Ciao.